The number of new COVID-19 positive cases is surging, with the country recording 602 positive cases in the last 24 hours, signaling that we are not out of the woods yet. The latest confirmed cases are from a sample of 5,618 on a day the country recorded another eight deaths, taking that national death tally to 805. In the last few days since the government relaxed some of the COVID-19 regulations, there has been spiraling cases of new confirmed coronavirus cases. In a statement from the Ministry of Health, 607,241 Kenyans have been tested for COVID-19, out of which 43,143 have been confirmed to have contracted the disease. In the last 24 hours, 602 people tested positive from 5,600. 618 samples tested, 585 Kenyans and 17 foreigners. The youngest to test positive is a one-year-old child, while the oldest is 93-year-old. In the statement, Nairobi recorded the highest number, with 133 followed by Nakuru and Wasingishu, 47 cases each, Kilifi and Kisumu, 46 cases each, Mombasa, 44, Kiricho, 32, Kakamega, 28, Trukana, 28, 25, Kisi 21, Machakos 20, Lekipia 13, Nyandaro and Bungoma 12 cases each, Kiambu 11, Nandi 10, Busia and Kajado 7 cases each, Baringo and Garissa 6 cases each, West Pokot and Nyamira 5 cases each, Makuweni 3, Nyeri Embo, Siaya, Bomet, and Vihiga, two cases each, and Wajia, Samburu, Narok, Moranga, and Meru, one case each. 80 people were given a clean bill of health and discharged. 80 people were given a clean bill of health and discharged. 51 from the home based care program, while 29 from various hospitals, bringing total recoveries to 31,508. The country also lost eight patients to the virus, and the number of fatalities now stand at 805. Beatrice Getonyangetich, Channel One News.